Yes, once again, fellow beer friends, lovers of freedom, men and women of goodwill, conscious people wherever you are all over the world, I will say good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and to some of you, good night. Depending on your time zone, this is Radio Biafra Extra. We are streaming live through Radio Biafra London. Radio Biafra London is anchored by the deputy leader of the indigenous people of Biafra. This is the current day Ubunigui. Radio Biafra is the current day Ubunigui. The thought of it, the wisdom behind it will elude the enemy of Biafra. This Ubunigui is under the control or caretaker of Manzu Chuka for me for. He is from Anambra State. Anambra State is in Biafra land. Abatiti inside Anambra State. He simply said, this Obunigwe will not see corruption. He become the Otonabuigwe. And now you will understand. It's a gradual process. That's which you may first simply said, I will not allow the heart of this project to see corruption. People don't understand. Rojas Ukurocha will be a testament to billions that he spent from the resources stolen from our land to stop this radio station. And when men and women understand that the power behind this radio station could only come from above, forget about anybody yapping and bragging. It's a matter of time. They will be a testament to the truth that we represent. You see, as far as we come on air every day, know that Biafra will come. Have they spoken anything that God did not turn up? No. God always responds. For we are men of peace. As we took for me for standing on the deputizing capacity on behalf of Mazen and Yoku Kano, the prince of Afali Ibeku, heir to the throne of Ibeku kingdom. Ibeku is in Omoahia. Omoahia is in Abia state. And Abia state is Biafra land. For the avoidance of doubt. When I look at something, they say, oh, I am a Bialian, I'm a Bialian. You are a Bialian. I'm a dragon, a Bialian with you. But let me ask you a question. Those of you from Bende, what is the meaning of Bende? You see, when we see, we've seen many things. We couldn't pick, put the, the pieces together until IPO became the glue, the bounding force, the uniting force, the delivering force, the rescue ship. And now everything that has been hidden for us is made bare before our eyes. You are from Bende, Ibonyabia. Please, can you tell me the difference between Bende in Abia State and Bende in Delta State or Setiana? But these are some of the truth. We will reveal it in the nearest future. It will amaze you. It's the same way I talk about Imo State, Imo State, Imo State. I do not dwell on this area because in the end of the day, I understand that this, I was so full animal, we are instrumental to create all this thing. And when I sit back, I see several, he say, oh, uh, I'm not going to do it. Ndimu, Ndimu, Ndimu Kwenu, hey, Ndimu Kwenu, hey. Then the other lunatic is shouting, Ndia Boy Kwenu, hey, Ndia Boy Kwenu. Then there is another madman juggling everywhere, Ndia Boy Kwenu. Eh? Then the other one, he say, Abaraba Nyanga, Abaraba Nyanga. All of you, when you are Abaraba Nyanga, Nyanga, and Kwenu, and Kwenu, go and look at who carve you out. It will amuse you. And then I love that musician that said, Mori Tola Muhammad. Moritola Muhammad, Moritola the son of Allah, Moritola the Boko Haram, Moritola the Hausa Fulani, Moritola the Onyo Shinonyama, Moritola Kere Imo State, Moritola Kere Anambra State, Moritola Kere Enugu State, Moritola Kere Daja Detai, Moritola Kere Upland Ile, Moritola Kere River and Leu, Moritola Kere Sideways and Side Drive from the Ara. 
But a man on our monitor and he came in in a naked chest. I've been in it. Oh, we've been nagging. May God have mercy upon all of you. Now, Fana, now one among so Amen. Oh, Setiana. You are a reverend sister, a reverend father anywhere. I ask you to impose me on our WhatsApp plan because I need somebody to pray Holy Mary for me here. Because the journey has just begun. Mazen and the canoe saw this truth. He stood by this truth. And look at where we are today. I am George Onyibi. I am from Abo. Abo is in Delta State. And Delta State is Biafra land. There is nothing that matters here. Nothing. But when it comes to the issue of Biafra, no matter what happens, the issue of Biafra stands taller and higher above all of us. But I must appreciate the Chukwoki Kabiyama. D. Chukwoki Kabiyama. You know, when I say D. Chukwoki Kabiyama, I want to let you know that any other one is counterfeit. Most of you think you are learned. You see something, they say, the radio Biafra. You see something, they say, the English language. You see something, the moment they put D, T H E, it means that one is the original. For those of you who go to church, that is why you hear apostolic church, apostolic ministry, apostolic anointing, apostolic Yoruba, apostolic Indian and Yama. But when you hear about the apostolic, it simply means this is the original. D Radio Biafra. D Nandekano. D Uchimefo. You know, D George Onibe. We are the original. We are not counterfeit. You can use to, you know still what who we are but you are not the original you are counterfeit we won't fight you because when there is original it shows there is a counterfeit inferior let us acknowledge the two cookie abiyama for when you tell me in english language that you worship god you don't know what they did to you oh, we are worshiping god but of course we still call him god so we can be able to tell you who we are talking. Because they told you God is the Almighty. But this is a lie. That God they told you is not the Almighty. Saudi Arabia know this truth. That is why they don't call the Creator God. They call him Allah. It is Britain that told you that the name of the Creator is God. His name is not God. And when I tell you now, you will say he's, uh, he's Antichrist or Anti-God. But God will deliver you one day. Because we are here to do the job of the Creator. So when we call him God, it's so you understand who we are talking about. Who is God? G-O-D. There is nobody known as God. Not even in heaven on earth. Have you heard and God said and God said? Except Oyibo o man rewrited it. No. God is an abbreviation. The same way Naira is an abbreviation. The same way Kobo is an abbreviation. Let's go by that so you will understand. I don't worship any God. I worship Chuku Kikabiyama. I worship Chuku. I see some Biafrans. Ibu extraction, I must tell you. They are, they are there yapping. You know, this is our one Nigeria. We're going to be Igbo presidency. We're going to romance Nigeria. And then we can be Igbo nazi presidency. But it, this, is, this is a dream that will never come true. You can only imagine it. It's a mirage. You're counting from the sky. You can never count correctly. Because everything that represents this Nigeria speaks against you. The Igbo Biafran, because they thought that when they get you, they get the rest of us. So wake up. Snap your finger and wake up. Nara means simply is an abbreviation or abbreviation of never allow Igbo rule again. Never allow Igbo to rule again. No. And some people went to Abuja with helicopter and private jet to collect 10, is it 10 billion US dollar? Is it 10 billion pounds? Oh, are you kidding me? It's 10 million naira? It don't have sense, man. Nigerians simply say their currency is never allowed Igbo to rule again. Naira. Do you know as a child, what taught me how to spell naira? Is that abbreviation the full meaning? Because when they say spell naira, I will now begin to spell naira, ndiara. I either spell naira or ndiara. And teacher will say, this is bad. You are very dull brain. He never knew. She never knew. I know the spelling in a different way. And every day I will be spelling Naira. Any Naira, ra, ra. And I, I, I found out. I said, okay, 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 okay. So when I want to spell Naira now, I will say never any 
allow e ibo i rule aro again e naira you don't have sense you don't have sense and then when they say kobo kobo give me two kobo give me three kobo give me four kobo we don't use kobo in biafra land but they are still using it in the north not because it had value because everything that they, regarding the humiliation of our people they must proclaim it before others they told themselves that will be the name of our currency and say when you are befriending yoruba you're going to love yoruba thunder will fire all of you we will come dad i learned how to spell kubu because i know it simply means k kill the next one is ojuku o before b others is that not your kubu you don't have sense but I'm, I have to bring this up because if I tell you I worship no God, many of you are going to say, uh, Onibe, how do you say you don't worship God? I worship no God because God, G-O-D, is simply the abbreviation of the most three important natural resources discovered in Africa. They gave you God. And when they look at it and say God, they were not telling you about the creator. When they say God, they are telling you the ultimate thing they desire more. You think they desire the creator is a lie. When they tell you God is wonderful, God is good, God is beautiful, God is awesome, God is toro 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 toro. Three things are involved there. Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit in the era. When we are done with all of you, you will cover your face in the street. Of the global community and you will walk in shame because to go kikabiyama the creator of heaven and earth is the lifting up of our head anytime they say let us praise the lord try and find out whether it's your landlord or not god is wonderful try to find out the really person they are saying is wonderful because god is an appreciation of humiliation in a particular language you don't understand people can say it's not very his english is not polish is but in my very lifetime i have seen english being modified and so you are very stupid and hopeless and animalistic and thunder fire you when you don't want to focus on what you are telling you god simply means g for good O for oil, D for diamond. These colonial masters say, this gold, this oil, this diamond, we shall bury Africa inside it if they don't allow us to hold it. It is the ultimate quest, ultimate target. Is God, G-O-D, gold, oil, and diamond. You will bury Africa for it, and you are going to say, let, let, let's go and worship God. Oh, we worship you, God. His name is not God. If you tell me it's Allah, I will consider it. If you tell me it's Elohim, I will consider it. If you tell me it's Chuko Kikabiyama, I will embrace you. I will not proceed until I acknowledge Him. We worship the Lord, the great I am. Yes, we worship. We worship. The Lord, the great I am. Oh, is Antana, the holy God and Stephas, the Lord God we worship, is the great I am that I am. Imakwana, any Najaya Mau, Makane Joku, Omara Mau, Adiamama. Ehuna nya ya ne nagi ugyo maya o juru nya nya dadio imakwani ngwe gemba ngwe o ndio yibo nande sabo geyegi afa di chiche ni ne ibu afa lo mega ani ni ne na sena ne de mau sabo inside of you be push on your demon I will kill all of you you don't know what is coming. I just, I just look at him and, and I just begin to smile. Don't sabo inside that POB. You are paranoid now because you are not doing your job. I will make sure you lose your relevance before your colonial master. Nonsense, people. And then when I talk like that, they're going to say, oh, uh, is, is he antichrist? I'm going to be antichrist. So if that is what we give us, Biafra, I will antagonize anything, antagonize it. You shall know the truth. Of course, I spend enough time trying to do introduction anyway. But I hope you receive the vibration. We shall continue. Our topic this morning is simple. Lamentation. By the grace of God, if I had the privilege 
to share this gospel of Biafra restoration, this gospel of truth. We shall look at my main topic this morning. But having listened to our leader brokers yesterday, in fact, if you have not listened to that brokers, please call your friends, your neighbor, tell them to send it to you. He says something there. Those of you who joined me on Facebook on time, you see, I re-edited the brokers because when I was in the spirit, was speaking Arabas, Kendoro, Bo, Bo, Bo. He said, no. I told you what to say. And then I re-edited it. Our topic this morning is lamentation. Lamentation. Our leader said something. Everything our leader broadcasted yesterday simply guide a new light into what George Unibe is doing. And uh, 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 we shall see all of them. We shall reveal all of them. Our leader single brokers, I have made more than 1,000 topics out of it. We shall be enjoying it. The right, we shall ride it. And our enemy will bleed shame and disgrace as we dismantle them, disrecycle them, disevaluate them. You are deceiving me. I look at some people, they think, oh, we are wise. We will deal with him. You will deal with me. Me, George Onibe, me, be a friend, boy. God will punish you. I'm waiting for all of you. You go ahead and do your worst. But we pledge a loyalty to Biafra Nation. And that loyalty is for every man and woman who stand to defend Biafra. Mazen and the Kano cannot be compared with any man. Because nobody has actually spoken for the collective interest of Biafran people. Go and ask Wazirike. Go and ask Nayango do Hanese Ndibu, Ndibu no Hanese. Ne Najadet and Ande Rivaran. They thought dividing us will make them control all you well. There is nothing like Oye. There is nothing like well. There is nothing like good. There is nothing like silver. The only thing you have is God. And you are there giving pain Yoruba people money for God. Somebody say, oh, don't worry. I have decided to give my tithe to you. I will give it or not to your Yoruba. I will be looking at them. Are you man enough to do that? Carry your tithe and look for IPOB principal office out and put your tithe there and stop fooling yourself. There is nothing like God. There is Chukwo Kikabiyama. Maybe there is Allah. Maybe there is Elohim. But the one I know is Chukwo Kikabiyama. Stop fooling yourself. There is no God anyway. Because abbreviation of God is simply the gold in Africa, the oil in Africa, and the diamond in Africa. That is that God. They kill you for God. They rape you for God. They murder you for God. And you are waiting for somebody to come from the sky. Nobody's going to come from the sky because you are very stupid and God will punish you if you refuse to wake up from your stupidity. And then, I thought you were a man of God. How okay, can you be insulting God? I never insult gold, silver, nor oil. I never insulted gold. Did I insult crude oil? Did I insult diamond? They should speak for me. Many countries in Africans, their youth will be slaughtered because of silver and gold and oil, crude oil. Britain mother worship is packing there across all the owners of Shell and Chevron and all the criminals around the globe. They are in our land waiting for us to make them and then they kill us. But let me tell them, we know the meaning of mercury. Mercury is solid in water even though it is a liquid. We know what mercury can do to your sheep. We will give you experiment of that thing you think you know. Mad people, don't be our water. The water where we don't swim. That is why I see people say, hey, I'm in here, I'm in here. It's just that I cannot swim. I beg, I, 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 I don't know when God is talking. I mean, when Chuko Kikabiyama is talking. Who am I to stop him? Let us move on. Our topic this morning, like I said, is lamentation. A leader and his brokers yesterday evening. He said, people call him and say, we are lamenting, we are lamenting, we are lamenting. And he clicked to my spirit. Honestly, I am tired of crying. I, I, I want to sing melody to you. I, 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 I really want to tell you something that make you feel like a human being, that make you feel okay, that, that, that will make you, you know, you, you, your BP can calm down. But, but, but believe me, a lot of things are not right I, I do ask myself a question and i will say george please don't say thunder fire you please and i'll say yes it's true i have to be civilized i should come up and lie with the both sides of my mouth according to which for in a very organized manner because when Nigerian journalists are lying to you, they lie in a very organized manner. I, I wish I could do this, but I can't. Forgive me. I can't. 
I, I would have been able to come in the morning and give you, this is early morning. I start by telling you, it's not my style. This is, in fact, let, let's, let's go back a little bit. This is what I would have preferred to wake up with. The, the kind of song I would like to wake up with that will enable you, uh, enable us to, you know, be, 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 be very, very romantic and uh, the, the, the grammar to put there, I, I, I don't know how to say. But this is the song I would like to wake you up with. Most of the days of you on the same time zone with me. So you'll be very happy. You feel angelic. I see you, I know you, that is why I know you the world. singing melody song then you go back to bed you will not go to work today but we will not do that we can't do that and that is why our topic is simply lamentation and leaders say they say you are always lamenting you are always crying we are always do this one but, but honestly we would not be here except there is need for that and so those of you in that line of thought deliver yourself or we shall deliver you when Nigerians were trying to bury us, assassinate us, they never knew we were seed. Now, look at where it has gotten us to. Look at it. But let us continue. I have over digressed. Let's just run through our topic as a script. There is nothing we can do. This is lamentation. And now I begin to appreciate the Bible the more. After different, different chapter, they now come to one chapter and they call it lamentation. Because at that particular time, the only thing the Israelites could do was to lament. The lament. At this point in time, there is nothing we can do as Biafrans rather than to lament. God is bearing, did I say God? Okay, you understand what I mean. The creator is bearing weakness. Weakness to the simple fact of what we are going through. I remember in those days, in the, in, the, in the theological school, they told us effective prayer. They gave us insight of a Yibo man and a black man. Both were hit down by a vehicle. They told us that the Uyibo man was partially wounded. The black man was terribly wounded. They told us that when they took both of them to the hospital, the black man that was partially wounded is pretending to be strong. You know, you are black, you are strong in the era. And that is why you are a slave, because you are strong. And the black man had fatal injury. He was bleeding to death. That he want to prove he's strong. And when they got to the hospital, doctor say, my brother, how are you? The brother say, I'm okay, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good to go. You are good to go, he say, yes. Doctor say, hold on, I'm coming. The doctor went to the Oyibo man that has a simple scratch. The Oyibo man was shouting, Oh, I'm dying. Oh, the pain is excruciative. I can't hold it. He's killing me. I am dying. I'm metamorphosing. Oh, do something. Oh, do something. He has a scratch. Oh. He's the one shouting, Do something. I'm dying. I'm doing. So when you hear BBC, CCB, Al Jazeera, CNN, Force News, 
American news, any news in the world not telling you the truth. Watch them. This is false alarm. Oh, we are dying. We are excruciating. It can't bear it. We are dying. Oh, do something. Do something. A single scratch. Oh, and you black man, very hopeless, animalistic, thunder fire you. Very babu and monkey and cheap as it, that you are. You are saying I'm good to go. Who the heck told you that you are good to go? Who the heck told you that you are good to go? And they told us that when you approach God, you behave like a evil. Shout to God, I'm excruciating, I am fire, fire extinguishing, I am burning, I need help. He gonna do something. If you don't do that, he also tiana, he got full faith. He am my to a case and young wadi mama. You are the one we are they are killing. Our leaders are the one going the whole world and say our land is pro progressing. I saw somewhere online this morning. They say, Oh, South Africa become the next country to do smartphone. And some of you believe this garbage, this xenophobia, useless thinking, led every useless people, all of you around Africa, most especially, working hard to stop Biafra today. You will meet your inevitable end. You don't know. All of you get out of IPOB issue, get out of Biafra matter. You do not have the moral standing to fight against us, spiritually or physically. You lack what it takes. You'll be humiliated in the end if you don't do that. We're not threatening anybody. We're making, sending a direct signal across the globe. When they, 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 they receive signal from other planets, it could take thousands of years for them to be able to narrate it. But I hope the signal we're sending across the global community doesn't take much time to interpret. It's there before your doorstep. So that thing you are doing, you are fooling yourself. I one time made an announcement here and say, I registered my MTN line with my company name. But along the line, they changed my company name to IPOB African Rep. And the moment I gave that announcement, they went to change it. You go go my MTN line now if you have it with true color. You will see any A, any stroke A. That is Nigeria stroke African rep. Invariably, they are telling you that African rep of IPOB, at least in this moment, the owner of the property carried the property. It's in Nigeria. I hope South African NTN will go and re-edit it because we are following all of you up, spiritually and physically. Ne nunala, we are following you. And having considered what our leader said, he simply said, people say we are lamenting. But what are we supposed to do in a time like this when they rape our women, when they murder everybody they can murder, when they do whatever they can do? And nobody's saying it. They are turning blind eye. They are behaving like crocodile. Are we supposed to be singing music? Are we supposed to be happy that somebody is giving you, is it one million naira, 10 billion naira? Not dollars, not pounds. When these people are putting on a wristwatch that is more than 20 billion or bi billion US dollars, including pounds, and then supposedly somebody who wants me to see him as my leader is rejoicing that they are giving him pounds and that money. Something is wrong somewhere. It's, there is nothing actually left for us to see than to lament, than to lament, and so on a daily basis. Every day, we come lamenting. We want to lament so you know what we are going through. We are not here to please man. Those of you who know me, the only way I can respect you is be true to yourself. We don't see fake people now all our life. We they see fake, fake people. Eh? Honestly, I'm grateful to IPUB. Grateful to IPUB today that even when I do not deserve any of the crown they give to me but yet they did that even when they don't know me yet they supported me i i could be grateful to them and i have more faith in them and i am talking today the way i talk is because somebody gave me the privilege believe me that is what humbles me i i, I am i am humbled and it cripples me somebody who don't know anything about me he entrusts life in me the best I can do is to defend that life with my own life. Because if I do not have access here, what will I say? And then any day I wake up, I say, let me defraud IPOB member, home and abroad. Let me undermine the sacrifice of men and women, home and abroad. Mechuko Kikabiyama wiped me out, my generation, make sure that the thought and the memory of me will only be cursed. The same way the thought of Nigeria and her handler will be cursed for all eternity.
I'm truly grateful. And as much as we have the time, nobody will know peace until you stand for the truth of Biafra. Until you let Biafra go. You don't know what is coming. You can be analyzing your computer. What is coming? You don't know about it. We are not there where you think that we are. Go and ask Elijah. When he seek for the face of God, he heard about thunder. Thunder was gingering. He looked and God was not there. There were lightning everywhere. He looked, God was not there. Storm came, Katerina came, Josephina came. God was not there until the still small voice. All those places you are looking for us, we are not there. We will not be there. We are here already. What are we to say? No message. It is the oppression that makes us shout. We're lamenting, calling upon genuine human being on earth and say, look at what we are going to. UN, look into our issue. United Nations, look into our issue. EU, look into our issue. We're calling everybody and say, look into our issue. We call on everybody and say, look at the challenges we are going through. We call all of you. We say, please, not because we're supposed to beg you to defend justice, truth, and equity as you promised the world, but because we know that when you fail to do that, you people will be exposed in the end. And so on a daily basis, we cry, we lament, because that is all that is left for us. That is all that is left for us. And I draw light from the single fact. Our leader said, they say, why are we lamenting? Are we supposed to rejoice in the midst of this misery? My topic this morning changed you. But ask yourself a question. Give me a reason why we must preach love, Valentine Day, eh? or this loving, loving day. There is nothing to see other than to lament. That Ojuku went to Abuli Accord with Gowan. They ate food on the same plate. Gowan poisoned Ojuku. Should I rejoice about that or lament about it? That the whole world tell you that they are here to heal the world. But here they poison the world. Why don't we lament? That they tell you, oh, you're going to serve God. You never know that they are telling you that you will be a slave to the gold in your land. As a Yoruba, the gold in Modakeke, you shall be a slave to that good. As a Niger Delta man, Biafra Mala, you shall be slave to the oil. As a somebody from somewhere, no, maybe Sambisa Forest, you shall be slave to the diamond, maybe other African countries. And you say you are worshiping God. Why wouldn't you be slave to gold, oil, diamond, among others? We will lament so you know the truth. His name is not God. It shall never be God. It is not God. There are contractors everywhere trying to deceive you. Tell me the name of your creator in your language. You will see his real power at work. We come here not in the name of any God, but we come here in the name of the creator who made the heavens and the earth. We call him Chukoki Kabiyama. We lament. We lament because things have fallen apart. We lament. We lament because before our very eyes, the mighty have fallen. We lament. We lament because the intellectuals are so stupid and hopeless than you can imagine. Yet we lament. We lament that the founding fathers are criminals and terrorists. And yet we lament. We lament because we want you to see that the most Democracy is the demonstration of grace when it comes to African setting, and we lament. We lament because those who say they are here to support us, these people are evil, and then we lament. We lament. I will be back in a minute. <laughs> Little darling, 
nothing we do on radio biafra rather than to lament we lament that you must see that water don't pass gary we lament so you see we will not allow this your evil exploitation and evil entrepreneur to control continue we lament stop deceiving us let us go let us be our lines are open anyway uh what's up line is 070 Four five six four two. A WhatsApp line I repeat is zero seven zero eight one five four five six four two. You are a Biafra anywhere in the world, you have not joined IPOB, you are part of the people saying, Oh, the, we are lamenting. When it is time to do worship song and give tithe to Yoruba, we will tell you. But this is lamentation. Please go to your Bible and find out after lamentation what is the next chapter. You will know where we are coming to next. Send me your data. You know, I know they hear English. Give me your name. Give me your phone number. Tell me where you did. We go tell the coordinator we did there to attend to you. We no one kill anybody. And any country will say they won't kill us. Make them prepare to make corn beef. Kill our people. Turn them to suya corn beef. Send them to us. No problem. Send every message where you get to our WhatsApp line. Coordinator we near you go reach you. I repeat them again. The number of that WhatsApp now, 070-815, sorry, 815, yes, 45642. Then our direct line now, 081-221-529-71. Our direct line again now, 81 221 52971. Then the line when he be say we live and for only our women, only our mothers, our daughters, our sisters, our wife, our fiance or girlfriend, as the case may be, only female. That number na 081-288-58614. Special number for our women, them na 081-288-58614. Now lament with the lament. Now cry with the cry. Maybe get one better leader. Wait this somewhere for this world. We go look into our matter and say, no, may these people go. Now make us the shout to. We know go they say it's a well, it's a well. Like a side church, whereas you know they side well. There is nothing well inside the well. We can't deceive ourselves any further. Are you there, Kola and WhatsApp? Yes, sir. Good morning, sir. Good, good morning. morning. Oh, wow. Go ahead, please. Yes, sir. Good morning, sir. Yes, it's a little contribution. Nigeria government, my name is Uwa Sophia. I, the next lament we will lament is for women and men we carry gun. We are going to bring all of you down. We don't have, we, we will not take decision for anybody, but we will do it with our men. And with our soul, we are going to lament for the elders that women and men we carry go and we are going to drop you and your children down. Useless people, useless Nigeria, useless Zoom, carbon 
just that report. Be. Thank you, sir. God bless you, sir. We shall continue. Thank you, continue. my God sister. Bless you, sir. God bless Thank you. Sir. Are you there, caller on the female line? Yeah. Good morning. Go ahead, please. The word is listening. We are lamenting. Eh? In the evening, by the grace of God, we will lament about the demise of our Supreme Leader's mother. Tonight, let the world know that Radio Biafra is lamenting. We lament that they, there is no yell in our land, building the whole cities in the world, and yet we, we, there is no road in our land. Go ahead, please, Ada. We are lamenting. We are lamenting. My Supreme Leader, May the God Almighty comfort you and He will continue to lead you. He will continue to strengthen you every day. We are sacrificing all we are sacrificing. And today we are lamenting to all over the world, world leaders, both living and unliving. And I pray today they will hear us. We are lamenting that we lose a mother who gave birth to a king. We are lamenting today to a mother, to a son to somebody, to a mother who gave birth to a lion. I say today, Mama, may you not sleep to your hands all of them. I am praying today, and we are lamenting today, you as a mother, who are you? What did you give back to? You, all of you, the governors, you don't have a mother. But the only mother we know is the mother who has who brought up a son who said that a local one and that is where we are standing who is your mother who is your mother you that is listening you that is sitting down you that is giving back you that have given back to your wedding who is your mother is your mother who is the one who has told you to loot and begin to kill is that your mother we are proud to this mother who has gone today and he gave back to somebody who knows that the life the way, the truth, and the life is truth. We are lamenting to this, saying, you as a woman listening to me now, what kind of a mother are you? Are you the mother whom the child will go to school and bring pencil? You will not ask who owns this pencil. Are you know the color of the pencil that you bought for that child? That that pencil that is holding is not the one you bought for him. That is how he started our Supreme Leader. The mother brought him up and said, and all that he's doing is to stand on the truth from morning to night. When you wake him up, what is he talking about? He's the freedom of his people, even when he's in pain, even when he's in pain. What is he saying? He's the affliction, affliction in his people. That is what the mother has taught him. Who are you? George Onibi, your mother said, no way, Pere Kayaji, Pere Ndokayani, Abuye, Nenu Nataya Kepo, that is what you told me, my mother told me, you can never, never sleep for a man to feed you, and that is why he will wake up, that is why she wake up every day, and carry her basket, and carry her bag to the market, never wait for a man to give him, to give her to eat, and that is all I tell you today, who are you as a mother? Because a mother holds a home without a mother, a mother there is no home. Women in her back stood up and carried their and carried their flag and blow and say enough is enough. Stop killing us. What a mother, what kind of a mother are you? Which you see, my superior wife, maybe I wanna cherry hara, baby yoga, chukun na de go to give, chukun na de kalogi, eo mun your man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Save your, save your tributes to our mother in the evening. Hopefully, our topic in the evening is going to be about that woman. It is going to be about that woman, honestly. Yes. I am so happy that women are getting up. I am so happy George will need to continue. Our God will see us through. All right. Bye bye and God bless Thank you. Thank you, Ada. And I must tell you, you are wonderful. We must continue. Are you there on the WhatsApp line? Call on WhatsApp, are you there? I am here. I am here, Mazionibe. Good morning, dear friends all over the world. My name is Joseph Biafra, calling from Neuom, Germany. Mazio Nibe, we are lamenting. 
we are lamenting. We are crying to the world every day and night, every minute, every hour, telling them how the government of the zoo called Nigeria, they are killing us. We are lamenting the way they are marginalizing us, setting our people on fire, humanizing us, killing us, raping us. We are lamenting. The world believe they believe on peace. We are lamenting so that they will come and make peace and give us Biafra. We are lamenting I mean that we don't know what to do to chase to chase the, the zoo out of our land. We are lamenting does not mean that we don't have power to fight back. But we are lamenting just because we believe in humanity, we believe in peace, and the world believe in peace also as they said that is why we are lamenting so that they will come and make peace and give us biafra but there will be a time this lamentation will be over we will say no we can't continue lamenting forever and we will take what belongs to us by our hand and that time the world will regret why they, 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 they did not listen to us me myself i am not happy i will not say we because i don't read people's mind but for me i am not happy i am ready to die for what i believe which is biafra and i'm already a dead man you cannot kill a dead man twice we are showing and giving warning to the world to listen to our voice now when it's not too late because there will be a time it will be too late. I will be ready to kill myself if there's nothing that will be done to, to solve this problem. I will be ready to take off my life because there's no there's no there's no life anymore. What's on you, but may God bless you and may God bless genuine beer friends all over the world. Thank you very much. That word touched me. They say, why are you people always lamenting? Are you supposed to be bombing our communities and then we are rejoicing? Are we that are we a pretender? You see, there are a lot of things people should begin to, to reason deeply. Because God or the Creator, they call him God. It's, it's not stupid. I now know why he said, my people, my children, my creatures, they perish because they don't lack sense. You are a very poor man. You are the one that goes to say, praise the Lord, praise the Lord, he has done me good. You are, you are poor and you are saying you are rich. And Bible says, let the poor say I am rich. But you still remain poor. Don't you think something is wrong? We will lament. We will lament. We will lament. And the cry of our lamentation will, will run all of you mad. You all of you will go insane. Imagine we come here and then we cross the leg. You can't tell us our story. This is one thing you must understand. I look at some people, they want to tell you the story of IPUB. And they've not been in IPUB. Come to IPUB and see what you are doing to ourselves. We tear ourselves apart. But yet we heal ourselves together again because we've all been wounded. And the best we can do for ourselves is to heal ourselves together. We will make mistakes, of course. It is accepted. We will correct ourselves because it is expected of us. We will poison ourselves. Of course, it may come because of ignorance. But we will heal ourselves because the blood of our brothers has value before our eyes. A lot will happen. And that is why we are IPUB. Very ready to... to, to, to which grammar go use? That is why we are who we are. And that is why we are different. What do we do? Come and pretend. And as I come here, I begin to sing. We tell you how it is. We are lamenting. We will continue to lament until all of you understand that your evil, heinous crime and atrocity against the Biafra nation, you can't hide it any longer. Are you there, call on the line? But of course, you epileptic network. All of you, the earlier you repent, the better. Because you are not going anywhere. We will lament until the voice of our cry will drive you insane. Good morning, my brother. Your name and where are you calling from? Tomorrow, you calling from any good province, Biafra land. You need to be precise. We have to lament because Nigeria government have dealt with us. 
we must lament they are killing our mothers our fathers and our youth we must lament we are not happy about it and what we are promising to them is one day we will retaliate what they have been looking for since they will get that thing thank you Major John thank you very much our leader said they said we 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 we, we always lament are you telling me when they close the Nugu airport and they come on TV and lie, we should be rejoicing? You go to Yoruba church and give your tithe. And when I say IPOB, you will tell me one family. You are not in one family for me. We will lament for all of you until you wake up from your stupidity, your hopelessness, and your foolishness. They will burn your market and you are going to thank them in Yoruba church and give them the remaining one because he wants us to be rejoicing you know the Lord is good our road was bad and that is why a tanker have to burn everywhere but why is our road bad don't we have enough money we're going to thank God that since I was born somebody have been promising me second Niger bridge and the second Niger bridge today they are promising my children because now I am old who the heck is these people this is a radio station for lamentation. We will lament till our lamentation will drive you crazy. Not mad, though, because if I say we will drive you mad, that means you can go to a psychiatric hospital and be recovered. It shall drive you crazy. Ndiara. Even all you met on, all you met on will be. Call on WhatsApp, are you there? Yes. <clears throat> Yes, I am here, my rep. Good morning and good afternoon from Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. My name is Yuriman Ezewem Uchechi. I'm from Ohiwe province, Biafra land. Yeah, the topic you raised this morning is in Concadas with um, our leaders, brokers. Last night, the lamentation of Biafra. No, when, when our leader made mention of that right. word, I, I, it revealed a lot of things. Our leader broke us yesterday. We we're going to work on it for a very long time. He said, lamentation. The spirit get hold of me. I say, honestly, I thought I was wrong. What do we do here? Play uh, Nigerian music. Orogo don't shake it. Orogo don't shake it. And that we are, we are rejoicing. Eh? Or we play uh, 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 Big Brother Niger or Big Brother Hellfire. Destroying the Biafran youth with reality show. Whereas the real reality of their suffering is hiding under the carpet. No, we have to lament. We will put the word on notice that the heinous crime and atrocity against our people my must rep, come I'm... to an end. Go ahead, please, and sorry for interrupting you. Miss Okay, uh, my rep, also, actually, we are in, the, in this together uh, because when our leader was um, broadcasting last night, uh, actually, all my mind just go through exactly to remind me the indefatigability of the one and the only African rep we have in Biafra land who is representing us, George Onyibe. Because when all those brokers was coming out, I began to realize, to feel what this young man is passing through every morning, every evening before he comes on air. Our leader made an attempt. The Radio Biafra on Saturday was broadcasting 247. Immediately, uh, uh, this guy from uh, South Africa went, uh, went off. Two minutes before the broadcast of our leader, I knew the hacking, the attack was coming from all angles to make that broadcast could not went on on that Saturday 19th that I talk, scheduled to, to, to tell, talk to the African people. And then maybe this is the first time even our leader tweeted it. It was the first time they succeeded when our leader tried to come online. He could not make it that particular day. This is the first time. And then I began to realize some of the things, you know, these people, what they are doing, especially Facebook, what they are doing, what they are doing is to pinch our mouth. What they are doing is to make us not to speak. Now, the lamentation, we are still in the state of lamentation based on, on the about 1,000 or more than topic that our director raised last night, which you are trying to bring in one by one. Now, you play one song now, selling the song this morning. Do you know 
These are the kind of the things these people want us to be singing on Radio Biafra. Early morning, I could remember those days in the, when we were in school. Early morning, we would just wake up and put worship song or put a, a lovely song, romantic song like Wally. So in your song, you put this morning just to, to make us to, to be romancing the world. Perhaps we are not going to be romancing it because we are having attacked. They have hurt us so much that this is not the right time for us to, 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 be, to, be, to be pampering war. Our, our, our rep is not pampering war. And, and just like our leader and our deputy, we are not here to pamper a war, to massage a war. We are not here. Yeah, that is why. That is why. I will look at some people. Then go look me finish. Then go, then go now carry their crazy and come meet me. I say, which can people be this? Eh? Trouble they sleep in Yanga Kong we come. You cannot leave me as I did now. I just be watching them because they want you to behave like a gentleman. There is a university that teaches gentleman conduct in London. You can go and learn gentleman conduct and come and live in a hypocritical manner the rest of your life. It's your business. You bring madness, we give you crazy. This is why we lament. This is why we lament. You tell me one is one, and you turn back and tell me that one is three. And when I question the, 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 the formula you used to give one plus one to be three, you now tell me it is a progressive arithmetic. You tell me it's a progressive arithmetic, and give it another name, and don't tell me it's a further mass or a simple arithmetic. You don't fool us. And somebody say, no, 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 don't lament. Be, be happy, and that we're going to come. I am rejoicing that Jesus conquered Satan. Now today, now she did for back. Eh? Now today, now she did for back. Get on it. This is where we lament. This and is where we, we tell talk. them the truth. When we talk, they will say we. we, 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 we. Huh? Thank and you. And then when much. we talk, they say we are insulting people. We Thank are you. so. We have, have not even insulted. They are very, very hopeless people. The truth we comes to them anyway. Eh? Imagine, imagine that kind of thing. What have they do? If, if they do preference, what they have done to you, will, will you survive? We have every reason to, to lament. Now look at how they killed us in on on each They brought a private jet for them to fly, try to fly to 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 to, to Abuja instead of the, the, And then when, when they the, came, when they came all back, all of them should fly to to When they, they come came back, back they, they now flood the media <laughs> and telling us, oh, they've given Igbo people <laughs> ten thousand. Is it ten thousand or ten million US dollar? Oh, Ibo should rejoice now. In the Ibo now rejoicing you. Where you go along in can according to according to Mazen and the Kano, he said it, it is internet money. Internet money. Oh, we are going to collect the Bitcoin, internet money. In the era, we are rejoicing. But it's a hate speech because exactly. this is just a promise that will never materialize. But it's a hate speech to them. Internet money. If you give me, if you give me that money. I will just appreciate you, you know, for protocol's sake. Do you know the problem in my community caused oh, by colonial master? And then those who want you to see them as intellectual want to deceive you with Igbo presidency. They play the game very well as draft, chef. That's how they are playing not. Chess, they are playing not like you do. We will fall now. Shabina will be the button. Throw us. We will tell you where all of us will fall into. Don't worry. Hey, Nigeria is done well. Yeah, oh, my, my God. Thank you very much, my brother. We must continue. We must continue. God bless you. God be with you. Just listening to them. And somebody say, no, you don't have to lament. We cannot lament, man. That's not the first time it's happening. The Abuja airport was... That leads me to ask you about the closure it of is. the Enugu airport, which also is not, that's not the first time it's happening. The Abuja airport was closed. What, is, what are the factors, like how you've just taken us through what are the factors behind this latest tragedy? What causes an airport to suddenly be declared a death trap and have to be closed? Why is there not constant maintenance, constant repair? The good news, of course, we all know, the Southeast governors went to visit the president and were able to come away with a special, a promise of a special intervention fund worth 10 billion naira for the rehab. Now, look at how they fool you. Eh, Enugu Airport is not the first to be closed. Abuja was actually closed. And uh, uh, we, we will not forget about, of course, the good news that they gave us uh, 10 billion naira that was stolen from our land and the internet anyway to a few good, good men to share it. And uh, why do you have to say that on our decrease? Now, no get sense.
You steal out to us. You are Yoruba and Awosa, and you are Fulani, you are British government, you are colonial terrorists. You think you are stupid? Do you know how many billion US dollars, how many billion US pounds you steal from my backyard every day? I am from Delta State. And somebody going to tell me, you are not as young. Thunder will fire you because I'm more as young more than all of you. You don't know. Have you been to Abo? Is Abo Okwan in Jean? You meet some people from Okwan and now they will tell you we are not Igbo. But Okwan people, Okwan people, or Ubiya Roko, all of you Okwan people, your ancestors came from Okoso in Anambra. And on each people came from where you are. But they deceive you. The oil in, uh, in Abo, is any Abo person enjoy from it? Do you have wood? Bamboo is the bridge that leads you into Abo. Do you know how many crude oil these colonial terrorists are stealing from my land? And you are giving one hopeless animal man money, 10 million naira, but you steal 10 billion US dollar? And they tell you Biget is the richest man in the world and is walking side by side with Dangote, who can't even spell his name? Lunatics everywhere looting us because there are some power changers behind them, and you say we should not lament. You poison us, you impoverish us, you endanger our land, you frustrate our future, you emasculate us physically, economically, spiritually, and otherwise, and you want us to come here and sing praise the Lord, oh single, single. And you don't know. And you don't know. Oh no, land your man, oh no, oh no, God, oh no, Baki come, oh no, Jay, and you're part of my casa. And you don't know. You bubble yaki, me buono. Are you there calling on the line? Good morning, my Good morning. Go ahead. My please. name is um, my name is Jenica. I'm calling from Minibu province of Biafra land. I want to thank you. I want to thank our leader, the strongest man in the whole world. And uh they said we should not lament. We will continue to lament. The world is on trial because of Biafra. She always says the world now is on I trial. know that the world is on trial. Now the AFP is now becoming a liar because of Biafra. Facebook have turned himself into those being because of Biafra. Which one will I mention? Our leader was mentioning them. Governors of Southeast and Ohanes and Ndo Namajiri have turned themselves into slaves because of Biafra. See how the world is on trial because of Biafra. All the people that always say the truth find out things that if you Google, you could find uh, the truth in, the, in their platform have turned to liars because of Biafra. Oh, what a word. What how, how the whole world have turned themselves into mess because of this singular Biafra. And Biafra we will give. You see, I, I, our leader has told us that the more have sacrificed so that Biafra will come because he will, she will now watch about I, I know that in my head. Because I know she will now fight more than she could have fight when she was alive. Because she has grown old, she can't do anything. But now, in the land of the spirit, she can fight more. And uh, what, what, which way would I start? He, 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 he talked, I was like, I, I jump, I, I fall, I, I, I shouted. I said, so the whole world is true to Australia because of Biafra. Because of this small Biafra that's located in the east here. Yes. Ha! Ah! Uh, that located in this West Africa. That the whole world has become a liar. Don't you see what they did in the UN? No country mentioned Biafra there. In that their general assembly. They are boasting. We have oil, and we can say oil yeah, to the whole world. That is the one they are pushing. Uh, we have this one. We can say this to the whole world. We have this one. They don't know that they are on trial. 
Nobody knows that they are on trial because of Biafra. And they have entered that trap. I told them that Nigeria will, will, will cry out uh, um, um, tears, tears of uh, blood will come out of their, their eyes. They don't know what is coming upon them. I told them, they will never ever see it. You see what they are doing? I was hearing a one television saying that the man, the, those drivers that uh, drives those uh, tankers, that is bomb, another bomb. They have done their worst. Have, th that they will pick up the, the, uh, the plate number and run away. He said that this thing is a target. How okay, the plate number is always being tied? So they, you see, you can, you, you can know now that these people have matches inside that their their tank. Maybe when they reach where they will they will start shaking the thing. And because I have been in a in a, a vehicle that the the man started doing something. I said, Ah, why are you assuming not Pasalanya name here? That he knows what he's doing. The motor started shaking. So they know what they're doing. And somebody's telling me they will run. Thank you very much. So that they will be rewarded in Nigeria Army. They will shake them and give them. Tomorrow you will hear that they are the, the, uh, the Nigerian uh, head Thank of you. the army in the other place. In the other. Thank you very much. Kadema continue to strengthen our Biafra. We will get our Biafra. Of course, there is no We will restore Biafra. Whatever it takes. You have taken a lot. I will not take another one. We will restore Biafra. Whatever it takes, we will restore. And show the whole world that they are liars. You see. Thank you, man. You see. No, as we came here now, we are supposed to be rejoicing. Oh, it's wonderful. They gave us 10 million US Naira. Oh, it's a Naira. Oh, we are happy. It's a work on development. God will punish all of you. It's an insult on our people. This is where we lament. You have the choice to listen or ignore. But all of you, that thing you are running for, you will do it. We don't threaten you. We make you a promise. Are you there, Colin Waza? Call on WhatsApp, are you there? Yes. Go ahead, Good morning. Please. Good morning. Your name and where are you calling from? This is Mazio Kichugo. I'm calling from Enugu province. Please, my people of Biafra, you have to wake up. This is a call for us to wake up because we have been suffering. My people on Nishi. I need the Nora. I need the Tenora, Chica Corno, as one people fight at this people because I think I watch and get in that game. I internally eliminate. Madinine Naya Ketaki in Nishag and then yesterday Oko Bana Delta, Nafioso, Oko Bakwanido, Nafioso. People show now watching it. Their friends show now watching it. If you keep quiet like this, Unak Hagis finish. So I'm praying that Madine, Gao Ibinite, Tiakota Kono, I fight against these people. Because on that, that Ibia Buayu, I told her I end up. Unak or her mother, Georgia, you will thank you. Thank you very nice. much. And they begin to ask, Why are they lamenting? Why are we, we will sing melody for you. Don't worry. Good morning, sir. Good morning. My good monitoring night, spirit. Good, good, good morning. Good morning, sir. Go ahead, we, are, we are lamenting that the close border, that we are not doing anything. <laughs> we are lamenting that border is working. We are sleeping in, uh, in our shop. We are lamenting that the, the shutdown airport in <laughs> Airport is working. The nation is down. There, there is many hospitals in uh, in Biafra land. We are lamenting that is many roads that that is a uh, uh, seaport. We are lamenting that all of them are working. 
We are lamenting that all the primary schools, so that students that are sitting on the ground, we are lamenting. We are happy on all those things. We are, they are sitting on the ground, or on the seats. We are lamenting. The way the race is 30,000 now. Hungry everywhere. <laughs> we are lamenting that is 10,000 right now. We are lamenting how they are killing us. In Anambra, we are lamenting how they promise us a nation, a president, to choose to present. It's not a nation again. If we are lamenting that in 2030, they will give us the presidency. We are lamenting how our leaders enter plan going to Abuja to go and collect 10 billion. For them, we are lamenting all the social media. They are working good for their friends. How they are doing everything, taking whatever that is happening in, in their balance. We are lamenting. We are lamenting the whole enemy that are around us. All, 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 all the enemies that is around us. We are lamenting how they are killing us day and night. They, we, we are lamenting how they to examine us. We are lamenting how they are, all the things that different people are selling, the damage. We are lamenting. We are lamenting how they are intimidating us in everything. We are, we are lamenting Thank you very how much. they are suppressing us down. God bless you. Thank you for We are much lamenting like how. Uh, uh, Chibike, Amesu Musa, Amesu Chibike. How is selling us? Chibike, Amesu. Chibike, Amesu, how is selling us? If we are not in any selling us in Zoo country, we are not in how Umaru, Umaru, Lord, is selling us. We are not in how all these politicians, where we call our leader, how they are. Using us, letting us be a lot of things. Secret society, we are lamenting on this. God, we are lamenting that the uh, government of Anambra State don't have with a uh, fire service. Thank you very that much. Is, uh, Edo. Thank that you is, very uh, much. Edo, 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 that brings the uh, fire service to come and set with uh, the fire. Thank you very much. Bye bye. Thank you very much. God bless Thank you. you very much. And so, before you get involved in Biafra issue, please try and study our history. Know the role your father or your mother have played. And then, when you talk, I think you'll be able to talk with your senses. You don't tell us how to cry. It's not possible anywhere. There is no gospel that we fit in this radio station. Other than this is just extension of our experience to the global community. And all of you are on trial. Pretend for all we care. Support the destruction of our people. Do whatever you have to do. There was a reason why there is lamentation in the Bible. We will be the hypocrites of the highest order if we are here playing a celebration music when we are supposed to be mourning. I, I, I don't know how these people are able to make stupidity out of those of you who want to make me see you as intellectual. They look at all the mumu they will use to cover up the issue of xenophobia. They choose Alain Unyema that I thought is a wise man. To cover up the issue of uh, market bombing by trailer tanker, they choose off a whole Yuanyango. A whole Yuanyango play that fool, that Mugu. The money Nigerian government paid to Yuanyango alone. We know how they settled him through the construction of a new airport. 
So Iwan Yang was telling me that when he was settled in pounds, that the one they give him to him, the internet money now, according to my leader, is what he make us supportable presidency. Thunder will fire all of us. Let us not lament at the end of this program. Let us sing music in the era. Goodbye from here. Thank you.